Do you want to say what's up for the vlog? What's that vlog? What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video, another episode of McGrath Fishing. As you can tell by the title, I got a new truck. So, um, I'm actually outside right now. I just cleaned my boat over there, drinking a cloth, NFL Sunday. My dad's right here, he's doing his rims. He also got a new truck too, so I'm gonna do like a little bit of that as well, cause it's the Denali family now. Dad, what do you got going on? Using some of this McGuire's. Actually, this shit works pretty good. Usually put on two coats, so I'm putting my first coat right now. And here, I did it on your boat uh, earlier in the year. That shit worked great. So here. Looks what? pretty spiffy. So earlier today, I actually took my new truck and my dad's truck to get a quick car wash just so they kind of look spiffy. Cause I want to do this video for you guys. I didn't want to make this video to like brag and get like a new truck. I just kind of want to make a video saying I got a new truck. I had a 2005 Silverado. I'm a big Chevy guy, GMC. I definitely would say I'm more of a Chevy guy in a way, but I had to go with the Denali. So I ended up getting a 2013 GMC Denali and I like it a lot. I mean. At the end of the day, it's pretty much all that matters to me if I like the truck, and I do, I like it a lot. So, I am gonna do a few upgrades too. I'm gonna kinda like, I wanna start doing a lot more vlogs that kinda take you guys along for like certain things, not just make it all fishing videos. So, the more and more I do upgrades, I'm gonna probably put a leveling kit on this one, uh, raise the front a little bit. I don't wanna do too big of a lift. Definitely I'm gonna get new rims, I'm gonna do that in a couple months, I'm gonna get black rims. So I'm gonna show you guys my dad's truck as well. But, check it out. Do you want to say what's up for the vlog? What's up, vlog? You always make fun of how I say vlog. 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 <laughs> like Chicago. <laughs> so guys, this is a yeah, this is a 2020 yes. or 2021. This is 2020. We're gonna quickly go over this one, but I definitely want to show you guys my truck. So this is a 2020 GMC Denali. Show you guys kind of the inside. Carbon Pro, baby. Carbon Pro. Guys, look at this. Check this out. Watch this. No, I won't do it. Oh, there it is. So then when you open that, it comes out and check this out. Like, say you need to go in the back of the truck right here. Watch this. Welcome to 2020. Welcome to shit breaking faster. <laughs> <laughs> but check this out. So obviously this isn't my truck. I just kind of want to show you guys because it's in the driveway and we're kind of cleaning the trucks right now, cleaning the boat. Getting ready for musky. Me and my dad are actually shooting up north and actually I'm going to post this video on Tuesday. Today is Sunday. And we're actually shooting up, so as you guys see this video, we're already gonna be up north. We're already gonna be in Monaco. And I'm probably not gonna screw around with smallmouth too much. I'm gonna go strictly for musky. I'm gonna buy all new rods, reels, everything like that, and really hunker down, go for the musky. I've never actually put the real time into going for them. And I'm gonna actually put the time in and see what I can do, so. Yeah, because he's not part of the club yet, right, Megan? <laughs> <laughs> Bullshit. All right, so this is the inside. Uh, we just got actually recently detailed, but pretty much uh, the standard I don't know, a huge upgrade from my truck really. Like I said, I had a 2005 Silverado and I'm not like a huge truck guy. I can't really go over like all the ins and outs, everything that this truck has, like the package. Um, it's actually a GMC Sierra and the Denali's like the package. So like if you got a Silverado and you got the Z71 package, it's just like different packages you can get. So this is the Denali and I like it a lot, honestly. Like kind of like what I was saying earlier, at the end of the day, it's kind of like what I like and this video really isn't to like brag or do anything like this. I just kind of want to show you guys like the everyday, like I don't know, like. We're coming up and we're doing a lot better like on YouTube and things are going really good. I wouldn't be able to do all this if it wasn't for you guys. Using my code and follow the action has helped honestly tremendously. And again, I wouldn't be able to do any of this without follow the action. So new boat, new truck. It's definitely been a solid trip. Got the basic standard, nice wood interior. Heated steering wheel. We got seat coolants, like the air conditioning in the seats. Obviously seat heaters, things like that, all the small stuff. Got XM in the truck. Guys, XM, the highway, 56 clutch but basically it's your everyday truck like i said 2013 gmc sierra denali and i love it i honestly really love it it's a huge upgrade it's got like little things too that it's like a lot different from the truck that i had like it's got this is a lot bigger i kept it nice and clean um a lot of my camera stuff goes in here 
um, armor all wipes, things like that. And I don't know, I just, a lot of different things that just, I like a lot. So I don't even know why this is back here, but we gotta get this out because I can't drive around with this. Got the basic back seat. These seats fold up right here. So this is, this is super nice. This is something different that I didn't have. A lot of room back here. I take uh, our dog Kenzie, who's about to jump in here. She uh, literally rides with me everywhere. Anywhere I go, uh, she comes with. So nice, spacious back seat. If you guys come to the back, this is something I also didn't have as well. Well, I had to tailgate, obviously, but Linex. I did not have a Linex bed, and this is a huge upgrade from what I like. I got salmon rods back here right now. And I was looking for this pole too the other day. But this is a big upgrade too. This is like little stuff. I use the back of my truck literally for everything. Throwing rods back there, the coolers. Um, and it's super like, I actually, a lot of people think it's hard to clean, but I really don't think it's actually that hard to clean. I like it a lot. Definitely a big upgrade. A little bit bigger of a bed than my last one too. The Silverado that you guys have seen a million times. That bed was literally just destroyed by stuff. Me and Justin went up King Salmon fishing. Skein everywhere. Literally salmon guts. Everything was in the back of that truck, so. Definitely kept this one a little bit cleaner. Keep this in now, or this in here too now. This like lays in the back just so if I have anything dirty, I can just kind of th throw it on top of there. If you come over here, right here. This is one of the best things, honestly. Buying this truck was a huge upgrade. I never had extended mirrors. I literally had the normal mirrors. And having this towing, guys, I can literally see everything. It's a huge difference. And because I was always like, when I was trying to like trailer, I can never see behind the boat or even really see my boat. I always had to like swerve to like move my boat and stuff. And now I can literally see behind my boat, like literally everything going on right there. And then these also fold in. So I'm definitely gonna do some upgrades. Like I said, I'm definitely gonna do, I'm gonna get some black rims. I'm gonna lift the front a little bit, like a nice level on camp, probably two or three inches. Kenzie, get out. Here, go in the back. Go in the back. But that's pretty much it, honestly. The GMC Sierra Denali. I like it a lot. Big upgrade though. Like I keep saying that, but I literally had a 2005 Chevy Silverado. There's nothing wrong with the truck. I just thought it was time to upgrade, get a new one. So 2005 Silverado to a 2013 GMC Denali. Another upgrade that I'm probably gonna do is these car mats. I'm probably gonna get with the nice uh, WeatherTech floor mats, stuff like that. I do the back seat as well, just cause if I wanna throw dirty boots in there, snow pants, ice fishing's gonna be, it's always a shit show. All your stuff is wet. You just kinda throw it in the truck. I mean, I got the bed too, but usually we got the big sled back there, the auger. Tons of shit, poles back there, so. Weather tech, also new rims. I'm gonna level this. Possibly a, like a one to two inch lift, nothing crazy. I don't want like a giant truck where I'm just rolling down the road, I'm six feet in the air, so. I don't know, that's pretty much it. I'm definitely gonna kinda like do like upgrades and like kinda show you guys what I'm doing in the truck like over time. Like I wanna start really like incorporating like my everyday personal life into these videos, do more vlogs. I've always said that, I've done a ton of vlogs, but just not like consistently. And I really wanna start doing that, kinda show you guys like what I do every day, cause. All we do, all I do literally every day is like pretty much film videos, go fishing, and help out FTA. I'm in the shop a lot as well, but I'm mostly just filming videos, and I want to like start kind of sharing that, like sharing my experience because I absolutely love it. I want to be able to get this far. We're almost at 3K subscribers. I think we're like 150 away. Without you guys, it honestly would not be too much, so I really appreciate you guys. And at the end, our half gears just half gears just went off for 25.1 points for fantasy. And what did I say? I said you can never take DeAndre Hopkins out of your lineup. I was gonna put Brandon Cooks in today, but I decided no. Well, he decided, he told me not to, so. Brandon Cooks does have 30 though. Yeah, I'll take the 25. If you guys look, these black rims, something like this is kind of like what I kind of want to do on my truck. 22. 22, so these are 22s. I don't know if I'm gonna go bigger on the tires or anything like that but I'm definitely gonna go black rims, maybe a little bit bigger tires. I love the way that, how beefy my tires are. Like these are nice and like good, but if you look at these, I mean, I love the tread on these. Like I love, like this is one of the, you can never go wrong with uh, BF Goodriches. So. so I'm gonna show you guys just a little bit more of my dad's truck. Um, yeah, maybe we'll continue this vlog a little bit. We're doing some boozing today, watching NFL Sunday. Let's take a look at my dad's truck quick. So guys, one thing that's really cool about my dad's truck too, is it's like a six way tailgate they call it. So if you drop this, that drops right here. You can drop this, then you can drop this as well. And then my phone should just connect. It's got kicker speakers. So I'm gonna get copyrighted if I play any more songs, but think about it, tailgating, this is like the perfect tailgate. I think this is one of the coolest things on my dad's truck. 
is this right here. So one thing my dad was just saying, like this is a carbon pro edition and it pretty much is like the bed itself. Here, I'll let you explain it. This whole bed is made of carbon. That's the unique thing of GMC with the Denali series. So in other words, compared to Tommy's GMC Denali Sierra over here and this, this, this bed makes this truck, the back end here about 250 pounds lighter. Obviously, I think he already showed you, you know, the kicker. I think he likes that more than I do. Uh, so to me, I could have cared less about that. Although it's, it is kind of nice to step in and out. And you got the features, what I like too, is this for an old guy like myself, you know, is you got the handle that comes up. And I know there's been, there's been a shit ton of uh, uh, videos on this Carver Pro Edition. But actually, I really like it. It's got the 6.2 engine in it. Like I said, for us old guys, to be able to get up and get back down, it's kind of nice. Uh, you know, I know the other truck, I, I have a hard time. Watch me fall on my ass now. So, yeah, anyways, it's got some nice features. I love the truck. Uh, I researched a lot. Here, I was looking at the high country. It's between neck and neck. High country, or that mean Chevy Silverado high country, which is a great truck. Love it. I'm a Chevy guy myself. I'm a GM guy through and through. But I decided, because uh, there wasn't a lot of uh, high countries out there. So but anyways, this was available, and I did a lot of comparisons, and I decided to stick with uh, what I know, the GMC Denali. Start the truck. This is probably one of the craziest things on this truck. So look, that is actually a camera in the back. So like that's not even a mirror actually. So look, this is the mirror. And that's a camera actually. And it's super accurate too. It's like real time. But then here, watch. I throw this in reverse. Guys, this is literally like side imaging, of like on a hummingbird almost. It is literally crazy. You can see everything. There's so many angles too. Like it is just honestly insane. Like there's literally, I think there's like 12 cameras or something crazy on this thing. But you can see like 360 around the truck as in front like i was kind of saying like this video is really not to like brag or i don't like i'm not like that i don't ever want to be like that like i of course i like having nice things everyone does but i just want to take you guys along more for kind of like what i'm doing like the the day-to-day -day stuff not like all right we're going out to film a fishing video like i just want to like take you guys along more for stuff like this and just kind of show you like what my family's up to what i'm up to and the everyday life i mean check out ken Hey Ken, you like the car? You driving? But yeah, I don't know. All I can really say is I like it. I like it a lot. I'm super grateful, and I've never have not been grateful like ever. Like I'm a super appreciative person. I've always am super grateful for what I have in life, what I've accomplished, and things like that. And I want to keep working harder and keep getting things done. And making good videos for you guys. And like I said, I just want to do more of that. I want to do more of the everyday stuff, just make video, just kick content out, but obviously good content. Like I never want to put out a video that I don't like myself. So things like this, it's just good because, I don't know, I hope you guys enjoy it. Like I said, if you guys want to see more stuff like this of the everyday, like the video, drop a comment, let me know. What do you guys want to see? I mean, we do so much stuff, so many cool things, and I want you guys to be like a part of it and be along with it and kind of like in the loop, I guess I should say. But hope you guys enjoyed this little tour video. I really enjoyed filming stuff like this, and if you guys do like it, please remember to leave a like, hit that subscribe button, two videos every single week, Tuesdays and Fridays at 5 o'clock p.m., and if we start doing more vlogs, I will kick out more videos per week. So, Meg, say we're out. Hey,